So we've just gone into production and all of your garments are under the needle. People are working actively on your production. They're sweating, they're doing their thing and everything's in motion. What happens next? How do I know that all of my products is going to come out at the quality that I expect it to come out at? Well, quality control is a really big deal. And domestic versus import are two different discussions. On the domestic front, it's a very hands-on process. So where we're involved domestically, we're very hands-on and we're in the trenches regularly, oftentimes daily at the factory level, making sure that everyone's performing at the level that we expect them to. As mentioned previously, since everything is done by hand, having tolerance with regards to our spec is something that is critical to your understanding. We have a grade rule that has tolerance. So if I'm checking production and we're QCing and we're measuring out top waistband measurements and it says that it's a half an inch off from what our approval standard was and our tolerance is a half an inch, then everything's fine. But we're monitoring it and we're policing it within those boundaries to make sure that it is in tolerance of what it should be. And that is reasonable and customary. Nothing is going to come out perfect. But if we start seeing holes and twisting and torquing and labels flipping out or snaps falling off, we're going to call it to the attention of the head of the factory and make sure that they tend to that. Overseas, the process is uh, slightly different because they're typically set up as a vertical operation and they have QC on site that they actually offer as a service because it's something that their internal staff manages regularly day to day. And it's their only way to really maintain that they're making good product and they're able to hold up to industry standards. What typically happens is that there are in-line sewing inspections. There are actually people that walk the factories to measure and spec out the cut work as it's being sewn into the first pieces of assembly. There's inspection at the tail end of it once the top of production comes out. There's inspection even at the later tail end of it when the actual final production comes out. In certain cases when you're doing wash and wet processing like denim for example, there's QC with regards to shrinkage and color tone and wash approval. There's many different facets of product that's being built, so it's very hard to say overall how it works. But generally speaking, before your production is going to leave a facility, many eyes and many hands will have touched the garments. And in a case where we're not producing it local to where we're operating, we expect TOP samples, we expect size run samples, we expect them to send us full size ranges so that we can randomly inspect and just make sure that everyone's in check.